Hey guys, this is the Tunator, and this is part 66 of my Fallout New Vegas Let's Play. <coughs> Sorry, feeling a little sick, so I'll probably be coughing a lot. Bear with me. Anyways, uh, I've discovered where Willow is. She went to the Mojave Outpost, which was my guess, so uh, you have to do this whole thing with the quest if you fire to get all these random items and crap, but uh, I just console kind of them to myself because I don't want to make you guys watch me, you know, run around grocery shopping. Don't feel like that would be too much fun, so... Actually, hold on, let me quick save in the event that it crashes. I have to work through New Vegas and just try and... Reduce my crash to desktops, but uh, until that time. Also, uh, someone tipped me off to uh, New Vegas Stutter Remover is actually functional again with the latest patch. So definitely go out and grab that uh, fantastic mod. It was broken for a while thanks to uh, the patch of that that same patch of Obsidian did, I think, that just like ramped up the number of CTDs with mods drastically. But it should be working again. So fantastic mod to have. Can't recommend it enough. You should definitely grab that. Great mod. Oh, it is dark. Whoops. Alright, now let me make sure uh, Project Reality is unpleasant because everything else I think is going to lag the game too much. So, I'm putting on that. Yeah, uh, the problem is with fraps, it just it makes the game take a pretty significant FPS hit. So, you gotta watch what you have running. I probably will take another look at my. Uh, much to see if there's anything I can I can optimize to make it a little less uh, a little faster. So I think this is decent FPS, but it, it could be better. Because again, fraps really kind of takes a crap on your system. So I'll see what I can do. Let's go talk to Willow. She's gonna bitch me out because I had to fire her because there's no option to send her to Lucky 38 yet. Unfortunately, since I haven't been to the strip, <coughs> which will probably remedy this episode. But in any case, uh, oh, and I forgot a. The lasers shotgun I wanted from AG Supplementary Unix is apparently at uh, some brewery, which I will have to find. Hi, have you been missing me? Indeed, I have. No, I'm not coming back with you. You sent me away and said you didn't want to be with me anymore. The DLCs made so, me, Willow. If you want it's me my back, fault. You're going to have to do something to prove to me you Fair want enough. me back. What? Uh, what do you want me to do? I want enough supplies to make enough coffee to last me for a month. Here. I'd already written up the list in case you showed up. Fair so, enough. So, will you do it? Okay. Right, and I will go look at the list. The idea is to used to go around and collect a bunch of random stuff, which I think is interesting. Is I do I do think it actually makes a lot of sense that there's real consequences for firing companions because in Fallout 3, uh, in, in this you, the, the default firing options are basically just like fuck you. I never want to see you again, which is uh, I actually I, I kind of disagreed with them being like that because I really felt that. Uh, there should always be an option, like you can do with a Lucky 38, where you can just tell them, okay, I just, we, we need to just take a temporary break, but it's not like I hate you, you know, just go away, which was unfortunately which you're pretty much your only option in Fallout 3, and until you get the Lucky 38, <coughs> is your, often your only option in New Vegas to lesser degrees. I think there, there should be like an option like that, just that just pisses them off, and then there should be an option like, uh, like with Lucky 38, but, but you can do before the Lucky Theory any time. It's just like, okay, we just need to take a temporary break, uh, and then we'll then we'll start, uh, you know, kind of trucking along again, which uh, I think is what should have happened. But uh, what are you gonna do? So I think the only thing I might not have is the soda bottles. We'll see. Hey, how's it going? Yeah, I'm still here. I haven't had any luck finding anyone to travel with yet. Do I, crap, oh god, that's just terrifying. Do I have enough, uh, Nuka Cola and bottles? I have to make some more. Balls. Maybe, can I buy Nuka Cola from her, actually? Background? Just my luck. What'll it be this time? Take a look. Please have Nuka Cola. God damn it. Ooh, step back though. I can sell all my crap to her, so I might have to take a quick break to look something up, but you guys obviously won't see it because I'm just gonna pause, but uh I don't really know why I say that. I should probably just do it, but in any case, yeah, now I'm rambling. <coughs> oh and that industrial hand reminds me. Oh god, no, not the Q thirty five. No no no. I need to uh to find, go get pushy as well. Got to do that. But uh, hmm. 
looks like a solid day's work. Does she have anything else I would want? I'm gonna pick up the radiation supplies, why not? Fine then. Hey there. Alrighty, hold on one moment. Alright, so I just gave myself a whole bunch of Nuka Colas, and let's uh, just drink a shit ton of them so I can get bottles. How's it going? Yeah, I'm still here. I haven't had any luck finding anyone to travel with yet. I have all the crap. What do I have to do? Do I have to craft it or something? Or purified water is... Oop, hold on. I think I might know what I did wrong. I might need more pinion nuts. Sorry for uh Hey, how's it going? Making you watch all this. Oh damn it. Yeah. I have all uh -oh. the crap. I know I have all the crap. Four block flowers, four xander roots, eight pinion nuts. Do I, I have all this stuff, don't I? Oh, damn it. I yeah, I the mod is uh Better than the soda bottles. I'm actually, I'm kind of worried that, uh... Tiny, tiny babies. Definitely not a Buffy reference, but it is still kind of inadvertently, so that, that amused me nonetheless. Dude, drinking these Nuka Colas not give me a bottle? I'm just like... It shouldn't... <laughs> yeah, again, sorry, you guys. I, just, I, I do really like the sentiment behind this idea, but I think it's a... I mean, it goes along with the treating the companions like real people, which I think is very important. But at the same time, it's a little inconvenient. Yeah, I, don't, I didn't get any bottles. What the hell? Do those seriously not give me empty bottles? Is it only the sunset that does? Wasn't that grand. Alright, uh, one sec. Alright, so I got all the stuff. I thought I had a mod on where if you drink new cola, it gives you a bottle, but apparently I didn't, so. Hey, how's it going? Got all the ingredients. Wow, look at that. Well, I guess you were serious then. So, I'll come with you, like I promised I would. Oh, I forgot about that, her bonus. I love that bonus, because I'm going to tip my head poison. Oh, it's a doggy. And we have the uh, ever-hilarious Cass. I love Cass. Right, let me see if... Uh, Do you need something? Are there any dialogue options? What's wrong with what I'm wearing? <laughs> I'm guessing that's not a good note. Please. Um, oh, god damn it. Not today. Damn it, I wanted to give her the, uh... Sure. Alrighty. Oh. Yeah, I, I wanted to give her the, I'm uh... The, the Jill Valentine armor, but we'll, we'll see about that. Uh, so someone told me something about this dog. You yeah. can maybe get it for her? So. Yeah. What is it? Hi. Not sure what I'd do for that, though. So. How you doing? <laughs> it's all I had when I left the Bright Followers. It's one of the outfits I used to wear when I performed on the strip. Besides, he likes the way I look in it. And I've got him to keep me safe. What more does a girl need? Clothes. Goodbye. See you later. Hey, doggy. Dick dog biscuit. Oh, it's cute. How you uh, doing? Let me make sure that... 
these people's options. And then the will quest thing, I have to, there's a, I want to figure out how to finish up request because I really want to be able to get her different armors. I see it for Willow. It's uh, anything that I have is going to be a, a while down there. Hmm. Don't think I have any of those. Good to know to watch for them. NCR. No idea what the context for that is, but uh. Hmm. Alright, yeah, so sorry for making this such a, a, a willow focused episode, but I really want to figure out. Uh, I'm just and can I just say again just, just how awesome this Brotherhood combat armor mod is? looks so much cooler than the recon armor. So good. You should all get it. What's yeah. up? But in any case, uh. Uh, personal questions. Sure. I don't mind. Let's see if I can puzzle out. Why were you alone? I hadn't been in the Mojave long. I'd arrived at the Mojave outpost a few days before, and had already split up with my last travel companion. I tried to find a new companion, but couldn't. So, I packed up and headed out. It was very unlucky that I got into trouble. I've been on the road for almost two years now, and that was about as bad as it's ever gotten for me. Although, I did Ooh. lose my dog, Big George, on the trip. He was killed by geckos. That was my worst day. Uh, maybe that's a dog thing. That's too bad about your dog, I'm sorry. Thank you. I miss him a lot. Sure, I don't mind. Uh, hmm. So I don't know if I can get back to that dog then. Uh, what got you interested in traveling? I grew up in Oregon. My family runs a motel that lots of caravans and sometimes travelers come through. So, I spent my childhood listening to stories of life on the road. I can't remember a time when I didn't want to leave and live out those stories. Are you from the Mojave? Will you be able to fill me in on details as we travel around? Or are you a newcomer like me? Difficult question to answer. Why I have that? brain damage. It seems I don't easy remember. Enough to me. Apparently, either you're from here and you know the Mahal, <coughs> or you're not and you don't. Right? Shot in the head and forgot everything. You know, pretty much standard for follow-up. That's terrible. Who shot you? Was it an accident? <laughs> no, 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 it wasn't an accident that I was shot in the head. But, but thanks why? for the sympathy. That's so cruel. But, but Benny's just so classy. I can't hate Benny. He's he's so awesome. He's so awesome. I was a courier and he wanted what I was carrying. It was robbery. So how did you survive a shot to the head that damaged you so badly? Mm, plus 20 uh, damage threshold and uh, nah. <laughs> skill, you know, skill. Happened in Good Springs and they healed me, but they couldn't fix my memory. Do you know who shot you? Uh, no, I'm still trying to figure that out. You'll be with me while I do that. Actually, I'll say yes, and I'm going to pay him back for what he did to me. I'll help all I can. What an asshole. <laughs> him, not you. But he's so classy. He's so classy. Let's go. Let's hit the road. Okay, so, yeah, that dog thing seems to suggest that this... How you doing? I need to figure this out about the dog. Hey. Yeah. Ooh, I'm interested in buying JT from you for 250 caps if you'd be willing to discuss it. Sure. Sure. Let me take him, huh? He knows Willow and she likes him. He'll be happy with us. All right. It's a man of few words. All right, I'm going to tell him to follow Willow. Yeah, we have a cool dog now, like dog meat, except not, but still. I don't think it, maybe I have to tell Willow to have him follow her? I'm not sure. What's up? Are you happy to have JT along with us? I am. I missed him when the big guy and I split up. But it's not the same as having my own dog. He does belong to you, after all. That can be arranged. 
Uh, and yeah, so I think what happened was I just, it's been, I did, I got, I did like the first parts of her companion quest, if you remember, way back when, and then I did all the DLCs, so I just completely forgot on like everything about her story, which is unfortunate, because there's really a lot there. It's very, very in-depth companion, like, this, and I think it's mo one of the most endorsed mods on the Nexus now, which is really not surprising because of the quality, but, oh, I thought you'd be thrilled. Really? Sorry to disappoint you, but I want my own dog, one that is loyal to me. Like I said, I'm happy to have him, but it's not the same. Follow Willow, damn it. I want you to follow Willow, not me. Stop following me. You've done nothing wrong. I want you to follow Willow for a while. Come on, JT. This could be some way to give him there. Hey there. Now are you happy about JT following us? Yes. When JT follows me, it's just like I have my own dog again. Thank you. Yay. All right. So, oh, God, I thought I see TV for a second. So this is courtesy of uh, Darker Nights of the Electricity, uh, which we will skip because I don't want you guys to be uh, unable to see. Although I, I do love these Dark Nights. I think they're very immersive, but I, I appreciate how hard it must be to, to watch on a YouTube video. So... We're going to avoid them, and I probably will turn off Darker Nights, because we should have play. I, I thought I did, but... So we're going to head on over to sunny New Vegas. Actually, first I think I'll go to the Silver Rush, though, because someone was saying that you can get the uh, GRA energy weapons there, which makes sense, and I do have to kill all of them eventually. You know, which... It really, really sucks that <coughs> the people I most want to kill in this game are also the... the the biggest energy weapon to you. Like, really, 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 really obsidian? Come on. The funniest thing is, if you're in the Brotherhood, if you if you want to join the Brotherhood with Harden, you, you have to kill them. And <laughs> the thing is, uh, Night Toys doesn't refresh her inventory, so you kill the energy weapon shop, and then, oh god, all my hotkeys. Afraid I'm gonna have to... Forgot about that, but you kill the energy weapon shop, and then your own energy weapon shop doesn't work, and then you're in trouble. Yeah, I, mean, I don't know if they you fix towards, but that's such a bad bug. Like, oh my god, it's terrible. All right, so yeah, I, I'm really pissed that you, this resets your hockey's every time too. But Welcome what are you gonna to do? the silver. Yeah, you crazy bitch, just sell me your crap. Auto gas stuff, flamer, which I don't care about. All right, I forgot the katana. That was a thumbs up mod for a second. Uh, don't have a plasma defender. Don't really want one. Uh, all these uh, a little too expensive still, which is actually pretty surprising considering how much money I have. But actually, I don't, I don't really have that much though. Even for New Vegas, I do need to unload these. No worries, I will eventually. I'm just stocking them because you know hoarding is fun all right so uh we'll go back outside and then onto the strip well i do want to see free side at night for a sec uh so just bear with me for like 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 10 seconds i just want to show you guys like how cool uh the, the towns and night, how atmospheric they can be with really Electro dead. City. Like, is that that's just we'll awesome. Some of this may be Project Reality as well, but, like, look how immersive this It's no longer, like, totally light-saturated. It actually looks like a town at night would. You know, it's actually pretty bright because of the strip, but just absolutely fantastic. So. In any case, uh, let me just redo my hotkeys. Still really annoyed. The casinos I can understand, but... There's got to be some way they can do that where you don't lose all of your hockeys, because that's just such a pain in the ass. Uh, actually, no, this should be out of one. It's my primary one. Put that on three. Four. Flash gun I won't need for... Three gun I won't need for a while. Uh, eight. Oh, I do have a defender, huh? The more you know. Six. And realistically, the only thing I'm going to be using is the, the LAAR for the foreseeable future, but so we're hey. just going to wait for an hour. Then I can make it bright enough to move on uh, in by. See if I can talk to her about racing her companion. 
influencer. Do you have a minute? I All have right, something I want to talk to you about. Yeah, what's going on? I told you when we first started traveling together that it wouldn't be for very long. But I'm having so much fun with you. And you've become very special to me. I think of you as a friend. As a best friend, actually. And I don't want to leave you or the Mojave. So, what do you say? Should we make it official? Shall I stay and keep following you around? Most definitely. I'll say, uh, I want you very much to stay with me. Great! We'll be best friends forever. All right. Hmm. Do we have some things to talk about? Yes, absolutely. I'm trying to figure out how to get her to change her, uh... Uh, now that we're best friends, are you willing to change your clothes? Okay, I don't know what all this stuff is Oh, wait, about, can you not give her armor? But, yes, if you're tired... Yeah. What do you collect? Pencils, when I scavenge right? for stuff to sell, I look for special little things that I might like to keep. I have a collection of those things. I haven't shown them to you, because, well, a girl likes to have some privacy. And besides, not everyone I've traveled with has understood. What? What haven't they understood? That it's fun to find pretty or interesting uh, things. Did you collect pencils? And a couple of the people I've traveled with have made fun of me for it. <laughs> I like to collect things too, because I'm a hoarder. I'm so excited you collect stuff too. What's your favorite thing to collect? Guns. Uh, armor and weapons. I have some good stuff at home. I don't pick those up on the road. They weigh too much. Let's That's hit the good. road. So now her armor's all messed up. Which is, oh, never mind. It's intentionally like that, but I don't know why. Uh, I, I was expecting. I mean, I do know why. I was expecting you'd be able to give her equipment, though. Let's see. Trade. Huh. Oh, now we can unequip her stuff. Carry. Okay. Gotcha. Now, actually, I can, I can give her that because she won't wear it because it's a, uh, it's pretty low. What the hell? Okay. Oh God, what? I'm not wearing my old clothes anymore. What do you think? What the? Do I look okay? What the? Hell? What about my butt? Does it look too big? Why, why is she wearing a dress? Oh, Veronica okay, must be very sure. jealous. Oh, it's a pre-war effort. Very cool. I like it. Why can't I give her her? Outfit back. Damn it. Let me see if she'll wear the ride here. Actually, it's probably because she, she's full on, uh. Wait. Uh, let's just. Oh, right. <laughs> I forgot I gave her all this crap. Uh, maybe she can. She'll take it now. Yep, there we go. Okay, badass. She'll wear anything now. Alright, so... That's the riot gear. And I do want to give her the, uh, the drill out before the end of this. Actually, let's let's go get that really quick. I want to see what that looks like. That was actually very cool armor. And uh, sorry for all the, the dicking around, but I really want to... It really is a fantastic companion mod. I want to kind of explore it as fully as possible, so... takes a while to actually deplete when I'm sprinting now. I wonder why that is. Okay, we may have to battle with deadly menaces. As I don't think I went through here. Oh, we get the dog too. Sweet. Forget about him. Uh -oh. cool as the ride gears, I don't really think it's quite fitting for her, uh, 
personality. Yeah, not that this will necessarily be okay, anymore, so. Sure. But uh, we'll see. Just want to kind of run around with it for an episode, dude. It's, it's pretty amusing, I think. Oh crap! It's got even less DT than uh, her normal outfit, though. Balls. All right, so I will edit that to have more DT. Eh, that's fine. All right, let's hit the road. Yeah, it actually does fit in decently with uh, Fallout as well, although it looks a little on the uh, the modern side. It's like not incredibly so. So yeah, let's go. Uh, I will edit that in Gek to make it not as flimsy, and let's go hit up uh, New Vegas. <coughs> <laughs> or the Manises could keep me from fast traveling. That works too. Far enough yet. Do have to check up on Eddie as well. Pack of companions now too. Although dog probably won't do too much, so no problem. So and yeah, like I said, once I get the that's the idea. Well, that's the idea. Once I get to uh, uh, like level max level, or whatever, we will be doing the courier's mile. Although I may not do it expressly as part of the let's play, but I will do a video for it. And rest assured, I'm going to be rolling in with. Uh, Willow, Veronica, the dog, probably Eddie as well. Basically, just the uh, the whole team. You know, kick ass and take names. Probably get wrecked, actually, to be realistic. Oh, this is the guy who you know gives you advice about the strip. But I, I got this. I got this. He's also one of the uh, like the you look male prostitutes you can so hire. Here's a little advice, friend. Don't go past the Southgate greeter without talking to it first. Thanks for the free advice. Who are you? The name's Old Ben. I've been living in Freeside since the day I was born. Uh, why would I want to go past the greeter? Those bots are programmed to vaporize anyone who enters the fenced-in area without authorization from the greeter. Never mind. Till next time. So yeah, I already know most of the stuff he tells you. Just thought I'd let him speak a, a bit of his piece for those of you who may not have seen him before. Submit to a credit check or present your passport before proceeding to the gate. Trespassers will be shot. Science 80, 1C, 3C, R, 34M. Oh, scale man. points. Ah, Thank you, sir. You may proceed. Yeah, the credit check, whatever, space, it's, it's very easy to get into this trip, but I do like that they had something to recognize. Entry detected. Entry detected. Oh, this, this fool, right. Oh, yep, sucks to be him. Too bad. And yeah, I'm not running the uh, it, oh God, the one strip thing that ruins the walls because with wraps on there, too much of a frame rate lag. Point me, uh, let's say, uh, it seems like you pop everywhere, Victor. I don't know most of the stuff he's going to say, but have him talk a bit for you guys. Oh, shucks, partner. I suppose it can't hurt to let you in on my little secret. Old Victor wouldn't be much use stuck inside just one secure trunk. Now, I can move from one to another with the snap of a finger. My God. Pretty nice trick, ain't it? Just don't ask me how I do it, because I don't know. This place looks amazing. Where do I start? The place to get started is Lucky 38. See that big old tower shaped like a roulette spinner? That's where you find Mr. House, New Vegas' head honcho. And he's itching to make your acquaintance. Can also pick up some money from this DLC snow globes as well. 
All right, I'll go there straight off. Yeah, partner, that's the spirit. He'll be waiting for you. All right. Uh, I think normally I continue a bit more because uh, uh, but since we're we're pretty close to the timeline, if not already past it. And uh, the house is going to be a pretty long conversation, I think. <laughs> I think I'll call it a day here. So, <laughs> sorry, the just ridiculous voices are cracking me up. Uh, so yeah, uh, we're going to talk the house. We're going to get started on the main quest. All right, we're going to go uh, NCR Pro uh, because. Or if Pro and CR, rather, because they're the ones who you can work with the Brotherhood on. And I like the Brotherhood more than I like any other faction in this game, so... And CR's got the best Brotherhood ending, we're going for them. House, we're just gonna murder, eventually. Nothing against the guy, except the fact that he hates the Brotherhood. So I was with him up until then. He asked me to kill him. Not gonna happen. Uh, and yeah, that'll be... Hopefully we don't see some kind of, you know, bitter rivalry develop between Veronica and Willow, based on the fact that Willow apparently has a dress, while Veronica does not. I do have familiarity with Veronica, the dress from the, uh... Uh, Ultra Lux doesn't all it really gives you is an an arm move, but mm, I just like doing it and I didn't show all you guys how to get the move for those of you who don't know. So yeah, this has been part 66 of my Fallout New Vegas Let's Play. Uh, as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you all next time.